While we're talking about our 715 uh, second date update, they were doing something in the kitchen and that's why I'm in the kitchen. Uh, but no, we thought this was a great idea that Adam came up with, but wow, Kate sure had a few things to say about it. Um, whose side are you on on this one? They actually went back out, but we're a little surprised. Are you? Let us know. Adam this morning, uh, he is a really nice guy. He sounds uh, like a good dude. He actually uh, knows his date, Kate, through uh, f mutual friends and had her over for the first date and said, yeah, let's do a little home-cooked meal. Yeah. So things sounded good to us. He said that she enjoyed the meal. Uh, after the date, she went home. They kept things casual. Hasn't heard from her since. And we actually have her on the phone right now. We want to bring her back on and see if we can get some answers of why she's not getting back to Adam. Good morning, Kate. How are you? Hey, good morning. I'm good. Okay, so I know a random call this morning. I appreciate you agreeing to come on with us. Uh, we want to talk to you about this guy, Adam, that you went on a date with. Um, I guess you actually live pretty close to him. You guys know each other through mutual friends. You went over there, and you guys had a little dinner. He said he thought you know, it would be cool to have a little home-cooked meal. You guys enjoyed that together, kind of just enjoyed each other's company. He actually complimented you on what you do for a living. I guess you're a nurse. We compliment you on that as well. And he said she's a very selfless person, and she, he was just really impressed by you. But now he can't get a hold of you for another date, and we're just trying to figure out Figure out why. <laughs> um, so he did invite me over and said he was going to like cook a nice meal or whatever, but that is not what happened. What do you mean? Yeah, he actually ordered, um, you know, like one of those things that all the ingredients come like portioned out or whatever, like Hello Fresh, I think it was. All right, yeah. But so he ordered that, which and whatever, make it and have it be ready when I get there. Like, that is what I was invited for. And I got there, and he hadn't even started it. So I ended up cooking my own meal on uh, first day. And it was super awkward because, I mean, I had already, like, I stayed, but it's because I was already there, and I couldn't really leave. You know what I mean? Okay. Like, who does that on a first day? Why would you put me to work? <laughs> was it that he just hadn't started, or was this his plan the whole time, was to have you guys do this together? I don't know. Either way, like, that's not how that should have gone down. Like, why wouldn't you just take me out? That's the normal thing to do. Or have the food ready. It was mm. just, I just, he seemed like totally clueless about what should be happening on a first date. So, yeah, I did not call him back. All right. Well, a lot to unpack here, but I do want to bring Adam back on to kind of get his take on this. Adam? Yeah. Um, yeah, I didn't really look at it as, like, putting you to work. We both just kind of made it and talked and drank wine together. I mean, I obviously was, like, way off on this whole yeah. thing. So was this your plan from the get-go for you guys to kind of do this together, or you just forgot to get it started? Yeah, I thought it would be fun for us to do something together and to have something to focus on besides just, like, staring at each other and trying to come up with conversation, you know? I, I thought it would be something good to do. You don't know anything about me. I actually hate to cook. Oh. Like, I, I just feel like, why would you invite somebody to dinner and then make them cook their own dinner. Who does that? Well, obviously I shouldn't have, I will not make you do that anymore. I'll take you off. I'll totally take you off if you want to go out. Aww. Um, yeah. But I, Kate, let me ask I, you a question. I mean, I, I don't feel like this, I mean, he sounds like a really nice guy and I don't think he had any ill intent on this and it wasn't like, oh, I'm just being lazy, whatever. Well, and not only that, isn't the food from those meals already cut up and measured out and everything? I mean, did you really have a lot of work to do? You still have to cook them. I think that it, the biggest thing is just like, yeah, maybe he's nice, but he just seems clueless. And I'm like, I'm over that. I don't need some guy who just doesn't know what he's doing. I can, like, make up for that. Like, I can make a mistake and then fix the mistake. Like, that's got to mean something, right? Like, you don't like to cook? I didn't know that. Like, from here on out. I mean, if you want to go somewhere, you can pick somewhere. Doesn't matter what it costs. You pick it. I'll take you. I don't know. I just don't have, like, time to waste at this point. Like, I'm kind of over, like, projects or whatever. Yeah. So, uh, it, just, it, it just turned me off. It was just, like, weird, and I'm, no. Well, why don't you sit down with me at the nicest restaurant you can find, and we'll go through a list of things you hate, and then I will make <laughs> sure that I never get anywhere near them. Wow, this guy's awesome. I was like, yeah, you're <laughs> How really did you not you go out with this yeah, him you, again? You sure you want to do this, Adam? I mean, it, I don't know. I guess I could give you, like, one more Whoa. shot, but oh. like, can I like pick what we do? Because clearly, like, you're not great at that. Wow. Yeah, yeah, that's what I offered. You, you, you have at it. So, Adam, you sure you want to go out with her? That's again? what I said. <laughs> I am. Okay. okay, it's a match. Yeah, is it? I, I, guess. I don't know. We'll find out.
Well, We're listen, excited. guys, uh, I appreciate you coming on with us today. I'm glad we can make this happen. Yeah. We'll put you on hold. We'll get all your info, and we'll set you guys up, okay? Awesome. Thanks. All right, hang on. Would you take out a girl again that said that? I will pick it out. We're going to do what I want to do. You have one more chance. No you, way. you know me pretty well. What do you think? There's no what do you way think? you would go out with a girl I was, again. That's why I said, Adam, are you sure about this? <laughs> I mean, I really do feel like calling him on the side and be like, dude, this is only going to get worse. Yeah, that was a lot. I thought the idea was okay, creative. Yeah, yeah. I mean, granted, it's already kind of, it's not really making dinner. I mean, somebody else like. Well, that's, that makes the I idea don't... even better. But she was not having that. Um, okay, well, would you have been offended if you were Kate? Would you have uh, given him another shot? And if you were Adam, would you have gone out with her after that? No. 800-992-1099. 800-992-1099. Hit us up.